hi guys welcome back to my channel like the title says this is the video of me showing you what i feed my family for a week's worth of dinners it is monday and on the meal plan is homemade sausage rolls and cheese and bacon turnovers they don't look the best i mean some of them turned out lovely but some of them have busted out the puff pastry where i rolled it a bit too thinly but um Steve said they're absolutely gorgeous. I've never made the cheese and bacon turnovers before. But I thought I'd give it a go because Shane wanted to try them in a bakery before. We didn't get them. So I thought I'd try them for dinner tonight. Um, we've got beans and chips with them. And um, we've all got pretty much the same. And I've got plenty of sausage rolls left over that everyone can have for lunches tomorrow. Like Wednesday and um, Steve can have them for lunches. So um, this is Steve, he's got one cheese and bacon put turnover, a sausage roll that's busting out, beans and chips. I didn't want either of them, so I've just got the um, bacon trimmings that I've just slung in the um, chip pan after I'd cooked the chips to stop that from being wasted. Now I've just got that. Chloe has sausage roll, chips and beans. Shane's like his dad, he's got a sausage roll and a cheese and bacon turnover, beans and chips. Nathan has sausage roll, chips and beans, and so does Hayley. I mean, to be fair, the ones over here don't look that bad. You know, the ones in the oven look a bit better, but maybe next time when I make them, I won't make it so that the um, puff pastry is so thin. So, but, you know, you make these things, you learn new lessons. So, uh, yeah, stop rabbing on. I'll see you tomorrow night to show you what I feed the family then. Bye, guys. Hi, guys. It is Tuesday, and for dinner tonight, we have homemade shepherd's pie with the leftover lamb from our Sunday dinner. Now, there is, I've only made three of them. For Steve, myself and Shane. Chloe's not here. She's around her boyfriends. And so Hayley very kindly stepped into her shoes and said she would have the toad in the hole with Nathan rather than shepherd's pie. So this is what it looks like. The camera makes it look a bit darker than it actually is, but it's not that dark. And then I've just got some broccoli on the side. I've put carrots in our shepherd's pie but there's a few extra because I cut too many for Haley and Nathan so I've just put them on the side of our plate as well so this is Steve's we have mine here and then we have Shane's he's really looking forward to this Haley has the toad in the hole some mashed potato which is the leftover mash from the topping of the shepherd's pie and then broccoli and carrots. And then this is Nathan's. He's just got some frozen roast potatoes with his toad in the hole and carrots. Because he will not eat mash and he will not eat shepherd's pie. So that is our dinner for tonight. And um, I'll see you tomorrow night to show you what I feed the family then. Bye. Hi guys. It is Thursday night and... Um, I meant to have cooked um, on the meal plan. It was meant to be pie from the freezers with veg and potatoes. I've had a really kind of bad, rough day. My legs are really playing me up and back. Nathan's been a little bugger and I really did not feel like cooking. So we have ordered fish and chips and um, it is a bit of a late one because they were late delivering. But here's what we have got for dinner. Steve has a nice chicken burger with salad and chips. I've got half a fish and half a jumbo battered sausage and chips. Chloe has a ham and cheese baguette with some chips. Shane has pucker pie and chips. Hayley has the other half of the sausage and fish and chips with me. And then Nathan has a jumbo battered sausage and chips there he won't eat all that but it's easier to get him a jumbo than at least then i know that there's going to be enough for him so that is our dinner for tonight let's hope i can get back on track with the meal plan tomorrow 
See you then. Bye. Oh, oh. Hi guys. Oh. It is um Friday. Friday. And it's a very noisy Friday here. Friday. I've just done dinner for everyone. Friday. I've got <laughs> my friend is here for dinner and she's reading a book with Nathan. So that's what you're hearing in the background. It is last night's dinner. So we've got pie and vegetables. This is Steve's. It's a chicken pie with new potatoes, broccoli and sweet corn. I am trying to watch what I eat a little bit. So I bought a steak today and I've chopped that up with some peppers, onions, fried it up. Then I threw a couple of new potatoes in there and a little bit of the sweet corn, just fried up a bit more. So it looks like a lot, but it's mainly vegetables and a bit of protein. Then I've got a bit of broccoli on the side. And then we have Chloe's here. We have Shane's, Haley's, my friends at the back, and then Nathan has a couple of sausages rather than the pie. Excuse me. So that is our dinner for tonight, and I will see you tomorrow night to show you what I feed the family then. Bye. Hi guys, it is Saturday night, and on the meal plan was homemade chicken nugget and chips. They don't exactly look like chicken nuggets, but they are, they look like chicken balls, but really nice chicken cooked in batter. There's a whole mountain of them, so the kids are, um, hope they're hungry. It's literally just diced up chicken breast, tossed in some seasoned flour, and then I used my pancake mix, my pancake batter from Krusty's. I have a big tub of it, and I just literally just poured some out in a bowl and added water. And then just whisk, whisk, dipped in the flour, dipped into the batter, deep fat fried for a few minutes, and then in the air fryer, they went to carry on cooking. So that is them. This is Steve's plate. We have Chloe's, Shane's, ha uh, a guest. No, no, that's Haley's. That's our guest's one. And then Nathan's is at the back. So that's their dinner. My dinner will be here soon. My friend's picking me up a salad and some prawns because I fancied that rather than this. So that is our dinner for tonight. And I will see you tomorrow night to show you what I feed the family then. Bye. Hi guys. It is Sunday and I've done a roast. Magically done a roast because this afternoon I have been playing midwife. Marla right on her due date has decided to give birth so I will um, take you around there in a second and show you what no she's still in the process you don't see nothing it's not gunky or anything so don't worry but I'll show you what we're having for dinner first um gammon roast very simple no Yorkshire puddings no nothing it's just meat potatoes and gravy we have broccoli cauliflower carrots and cabbage roast potatoes and gammon this is Steve's we have mine here with sweet potatoes rather than normal. We have Shane's. We have no Chloe, she's at Boyfriend's. We have Haley's here. We have Nathan's. We have surplus gammon. And if you can ignore the whingy, teen, whingy toddler, I'll walk you around and show you. Once again, right on call, she decided not to give birth where I wanted her to. She's doing it in the um, front room. And I don't know if you can see anything or not. It's wiggling around down there. There you go. You see it? Right there. There's one little kitten. So there we go. So we're going to leave her in peace. So we're going to back up Nathan. And there will be more later. So um, that is Sunday. Oh, stacking it over Nathan. Shane, get your bum out of the way unless you're going to end up in the video. That is our meals of the week. Thumbs up if you like this video, please. And um, subscribe if you haven't done so already. Hit the notification bell so that YouTube tells you every time I upload a new video. That includes my meals of the week, shopping hauls. And if you guys are interested, now kitten updates. So I will see you next week, hopefully. Bye.